Tens of farmers in Kajado are counting losses after a herd of elephants invaded their farms following the ravaging drought situation in the region. The escalating human wildlife conflict has also affected learning as pupils cannot access school due to the danger posed by the elephants. Carrying arms in the company of their children groomed in their school uniforms, residents of Olongosua village marched to the local chief's office to present their grievances after a herd of elephants invaded their farms, leaving behind a trail of destruction. <laughs> This coming just a day after a pupil from Longosua Primary School missed death by a whisker after an attack by elephants. The village located in Kajado Central has become the epicenter of human wildlife conflict affecting the locals' livelihoods and is now likely to affect the school calendar after locals vowed not to allow the resumption of school if the situation is not addressed. <laughs> Locals are faulting the Kenya Wildlife Service leadership for not taking prompt action despite the numerous appeals for intervention, promising not to relent until their voices are heard. KNWS, Mukuba KNWS, Natana Nalilia Kiongozi Yetu, Kama Governor. Kama eh, MCA, Kama Mbunge, Kama Senator, Bakara Ledema, Alekena Ikua, Naro. I have to say, dear, Kawanya Mabori. When the Bomba came to WS, Mukuje, Muchuku, Wanyama Wenu, Kabla Aijatoa, Madara. Nana Rudia, Kabla Aijatoa, Madara. Atutaki at one by Nachukulua, Wakati, Watu, Amukufa. Atutaki. Trevor Nendo for Lunchtime News.